Despite what Active Captain tells you, you're not going to be able to land at the government dock. Instead, pick Farrington's dock behind the gazebo. In the back behind him, it's a bar here. And a store trying to get stuff washed. So we can go pick up some beers and have a few and uh, wait for it to get done. I'm watching another beautiful day. Well, this bar that we usually get a couple of clicks at is shut down right now and it doesn't look like it's going to open. According to the proprietor, um, looks like uh, they all stayed up to like 4 a.m. And so they're having a hard time making it in today. So, oh well. It runs the restaurant bar here. He also has the convenience store, laundry, can get you ice, and even rent you some cars. So really, he can do a little bit of everything for you here in Hatchet Bay. Alright, so we're ending another day in Hatchet Bay. And uh, we're going to cook some fish and pasta for the friends. Okay, today's meal is basically lane snapper, fresh caught lane snapper. Um, we're gonna make a uh, lemon butter kind of cream sauce. Um, we put it over the fish as well as some uh, pasta. It's pretty easy to prep. We just salt and uh, pepper. In our case, I'm gonna cheat a little. Uh, tuna casseries, two old seasonings, and uh, pan fry it in olive oil. We get the drippings from the fish, then we uh, deglaze with uh, some lemon or white wine, and add a little bit of stock that we made out of uh, onions, cabbage, and garlic, and uh, thicken it up with a little bit of uh, blonde root. The next day we continued our tour of Alice Town. And we wanted to get something to eat that locals eat, so we stopped and got some curry chicken at this small restaurant. We met the owner of the restaurant, and then we met his sister, the owner of the bar next door. All right, the rainstorm is hitting Venalinas now. But we're safe in this little bar. The owner of this bar would later put us in touch with her sister who rents cars in Governor's Harbor. And she would give us a sweet deal on a ride. Dogs are everywhere. Cute dogs. I don't understand why you're taking off. First you say you love me, now you're breaking it off. You had me at a low end. Has go and collected your green. Easily it seems. Oh. 
Tell me did I do bit better. I love giving the answer. It's probably a fascination I developed because in New Orleans, we have the coolest graves above ground. Final resting place. This, won't be my heart this ain't so bad as a final resting place. This will be your mistake. He's over there, though. Are there fish in those caves? There's probably fish in those caves. Let me figure it out. They're probably ancient dead fish. This will be your mistake. It won't be my heart. Okay, so here we go. We're walking to see some cave here on the Luthra. Two crews, Danilinus and Voyager, on the two mile walk to the caves. You were all I've ever seen. Here go the chickens crossing the road. You were all I still cannot answer why. What's your name? Neil. Neil, pleasure yeah. to meet you, man. Thank you very much for the ride. I'll try to get this door shut for you. Good guy. Well, that seems to be the best way to get around here in Eleuthera is hitchhiking. And we're at the Hatchet Bay Cave near these silos. So, we just hitchhiked from the edge of Hatchet Bay, two miles to go to the caves, and now we're on a long walk, it appears, to go and see the caves. So this is it, this is the entry to the caves. And uh, as always, we always send the children first. That way, if there's anything in there that could eat them, it eats them first, and we're still here. Yep. Right? Correct, though. Who wants to go forward with the Maybe. flashlight first? I'll go. All right. Alright, I don't know if anybody 
I don't know if I'm going to show up here. But this cave here in Eleuthera is a pretty, pretty cool. There, there are dates on here. The earliest one we've seen was like 1896, um, but lots from 1902. Uh, I mean, this is written with charcoal, 1896. There's another one, 1896. It is, ceiling's getting a little lower, so might be shutting the camera off here in a second just so I can crawl through. All right, you don't have to go far under the cave. And then it opens up and you can climb out a little rope ladder. Awesome. Great, great time exploring this cave. Okay. This is it. This is the hole. We got to crawl up from down there. Well, I guess you could crawl down from here. Then you take this trail to the next segment, which I'm probably not doing. It's not a long walk on this trail to get back to the cave entrance or parking lot. And from there, you can walk to the highway and hitchhike to wherever it is you need to go. In this case, we were headed to Gregory Town. It's a pretty awesome way to travel too. And you get to meet people who have lots of local knowledge and they really want to share it with you.
that come out of uh, Eleuthera, but that's where we're going, Governor's Harbor. <laughs> 